Hello, welcome back to Founding Core Plays Imperion Galactic Survival. So, I got in the process of making a CPU extender and a advanced constructor. And the reason that is, is because there's a few items that I want to get that you can't get unless you have an advanced constructor. But what was holding us back was the CPU. If you look, it requires 20,000. Well, what we have for our base when it comes to CPU is 80,000 is our max. We're allocated right now at 76,000. So if I put it in, it put us over it. So with that tier two, it would put us up to 200,000, which will be good. Now, I'm also going to have to worry about power because this requires 1.5 kilowatts. And how much do we produce? Two point five, so we're good. I think we have two generators. Okay. I guess not. Which one is this? It's just the generator. Which is weird because that doesn't make any sense how a small generator it puts out 2.5 kilowatts okay I stand corrected what are we lacking it's saying we don't have enough I don't understand what what is it that we're short on I guess maybe, maybe iron. Well, let's go get some iron real quick. Uh, let's eat first. All right, there we go. Yeah, let's just go. Let me throw my well let me get out first ah oh, come on let me go ahead and toss toss this down like this better. Yeah. Cool. Make sure nothing's done real quick. We're good. Good. All right, let's go. I want to get away from the base, and that's really loud in my ears. Let's see where we can find some iron at. I can always travel to space, but right there. Which direction is that? Eastish? There it is. 
I love how it even throws the name in there too. That's pretty good. There's some big stones right there. It was so nice before when it was kind of when it was kind of bright out. Not necessarily as it is like right now for daylight, but it used to be really, really good to where you can even travel out during the nighttime. I was trying to help my uh, turrets to take out this drone. Before clowns like them try to come over and aggravate me. Make sure nothing else is right up on me. Does that look like a different creature? Oh, it is. It's sandworm. Okay, I was going to say, what is going on here? Alright, we're good. I don't care if it screwed my standing with Zyrax, even though it's still hostile, so it doesn't matter. I'm surprised I don't see any more woodwalkers. That's always weird, not seeing them anymore. I'm sure they're still around, just don't see them as often anymore. Whoa! Whoa!
hair. I'm all about that. Iron deposit is right here. And it happens to be right beside a survival camp, which is survivor camp, not survival. Whatever, that's bullshit. They somehow have the most perfect aim ever. Most perfect aim, like they can never miss. Now you know that's a load of shit right there. That they're able to just straight out kill you. We know that's a load of bullshit. Look at that. See? Still perfect shot. Perfect shot every single time. Perfect. Can never miss. Bastards can never miss. This is why I don't like getting out of my ship. Trying to be quick about 
this. I don't want to lose anything. I'm trying to get whatever they have on their body is not worth dealing with bullshit. Oh, come on. And let me throw some fuel. came over here just to get iron.
Well, we're already over here. We might as well see what's at in the survivor camp. try infiltrating a base. So, we'll see. I mean, we'll need to make sure all our guns are repaired. Make sure we have food. Um, I bet you my armor, yeah, my armor shot. I need to build a repair thing so I can repair all my stuff. That would be super nice. Get ready because we're probably going to have a base attack here, here shortly. some of this put in the fridge first and then we'll put the rest inside the base I knew it was gonna happen this can go in the ammo all right let's go back to our small vessel really didn't even get a whole lot of iron. Nothing showing up yet. So I'm going to take half this. Put it in there to make more iron. There we go, because I'm pretty sure it's going to show up on the map any second now. I know I need to add more turrets. Like, what I want to put is, I got a turret here, but I want to raise it up a little higher. And then I want to put, like, one over there and one right over here, so we can, like, cross hit them. Wait, 
What is going on? Why is this doing that? What is going on? I had so much iron. Oh, because it's right there. I was like, what the shit is going on? wish it would tell me where it the ship got destroyed at a lot easier than what it does like holy shit we destroyed it and it's way the fuck over here I see you little bastards over there I didn't ever put any of the other turrets is because whenever uh, they made all the enemies harder the minigun turrets were what was best for air defense but now it seems like that's not becoming the case anymore it's almost like it's better to have a mixture there we go Now that gave us a good bit of uh, iron. It's not a lot, but... Cha-ching. I saw that our crops are done, so we'll get to that in a second. Um, let's throw some ammo in here. Like all of it. <laughs> ah, I clicked on the wrong thing. Let's try this again. Let's turn that off. Let's go back to my ship. And let's throw that in there. There. I'm not connected, so we're good. Oh, it looked like it was done. These are, though. Nice. And now we'll start making cheeseburgers. Because... We're using the fuel to make just bottles of water. Granted, it does give us oxygen, but at the cost of making basically, it doesn't take much. We need to make because see, this just needs meat, bread, and cheese. Which, all that's easy to make now. But milk is plant protein and purified water. Which, you take the... Is it milk? Yeah, to make cheese. Cheese is just milk. So plant protein and purified water makes your cheese. Then bread is just flour and purified water. So you need two bottles of water. One here, one there. And then one meat, which is two plant protein and one vegetable. So really, in, 
it's three plant protein, one vegetable, two purified water, one flour, and that's it. Which, we're, like I said, we're making purified water outside. So let's do this. I did throw all that in there. We've, we're cleared now. Uh, let's make sure we're not needing anything. I'm almost hungry. Let's try to go through all the rest of this ham. There we go. All right, can we make it now? Can we make the large constructor without an issue? All right, advance. Okay, what's the issue? I've got plenty of, okay, maybe it's copper. Maybe it's a lack of copper. Well, let's, let's first see if we need any repairs. real quick nothing okay so let's get back in our ship let's think real quick where we can get some copper at there ain't gonna be none here um no here we go It'll be in our system. Our system should have some. All right, well, we'll go to space. If I can freaking see. space get some copper maybe this is what's holding us back all right I'm gonna put on cruise control nice copper is right above me and there it is Hopefully that drone harvester doesn't come aggravate me. Let's go ahead and cut our speed down a little bit. Here we go. Let's get us this copper. And any crushed stone I get, I can always turn it into copper. And copper is lighter than iron ore, so that's always good. be pointless but well it would be completely pointless but you could sit there and grow all the uh, 
plant fibers that make biofuel and use that to power your ship. You can turn off all the major systems uh, other than, well, not your major, but like your thrusters and all that, and you can turn it into a base if you want it to be planet side. Let's make sure nothing's getting up on me. those drone scavengers only exist because of you shooting down the Xyrax interdictors. I wonder if that's why they even show up. what I'm going to do. I'm going to go to the harvest controller. Take out this. Throw that in there because that's going to... Oh, there's ham in there? Nice. Take out a bunch of that. Throw what I can in there. Go back to my harvest controller. Boom. Look at that. Look at all that room now. Now, I will need some more cobalt, so I may, may make another run. Something seems like it's getting awfully close. It just it feels like it. That's 8.15. How far is that other one? 5.66. So we're good. Maybe that's Polaris. I might go see if that's Polaris. Deal. I mean, we need copper anyway, but if it is, then awesome.
that tripped me out. Let's, let's clear this out. push it any further. I got lucky with the one. I want to see... No, that's the drone harvester. That clown is coming too close. Let's see who this is. I want to see who this is on that heat signature over here. It may be a drone harvester. But I'd like to be able to locate who's who's who and where. I mean, it's the same color as Polaris. Polaris might be a little darker orange, but it's kind of hard to tell. And see, they need to fix that. It says the range is 4.97 miles. So that means here at uh, 4.97 miles, I should be able to detect, detect them. But it doesn't work like that. See? I don't know who they are. Yet I can detect them all the way further than 4.9.7 miles. 4.97 miles. Well, let's bump the speed up. See, they need to fix that too. And I'm traveling slower because we're way down. Really, you'll be able to know who it is, I think, within like, like a mile. So we're about to find out. Right now, I'm just making sure I don't see any eyes coming at me. Not eyes, exclamation points. Who is it? Yep, yeah, that's what I thought it was. I figured it was the drone harvester, but... They're trying to converge on me, you see that? It ain't gonna happen. For one, I'll shoot them down if they get too close. And two, we're obviously gonna be orbiting the planet. Well, we'll not necessarily orbit, we'll cross through its orbit. Here we go. Now hopefully this is what, what was holding us back from making that advanced constructor. it could be is a cobalt that I can think of. Alright, let's see. One way we can do this is like this. Base Throw that in there. Now let's see. That's what it was. It was the copper. 
So let's go out here and turn it all into copper ingots. All right, go ahead and start making them. Wrong thing. Small vessel. Give me that. We got a good bit. Holy crap. I can't believe we got almost a... Well, we got a thousand. I would put it in there, but that will turn the... Well, I've already got a lot in there. Well, let's keep throwing it in there. Let me do that. Crap. What? No. It's not at all what I... I got a thousand stone and that wasn't even intentional. Nice, 260 already. Let's make that advanced constructor now, finally. I need more electronics that I know make electronics. Okay, well let me see what I need to make for electronics. So I'll get a bunch of that to make too. Copper ingot and silver ingot. So I've got copper ingot already out there. Let's grab some silicon. Take this and some copper. Ah, uh, this is gonna suck. Make a hundred of them. Two to one, ain't it? Yeah. So we'll take some of that out because it's not going to be able to make a whole lot. Because it's a two to one ratio. So if you have 200 silicon ingots, you only need 100 copper. And then I wish we could make cobalt outside, but you can't. Now what kills me is there is never a time where you need to use a furnace. Ex Let me rephrase that. The only time you'll ever need to use a furnace is to do like cobalt, titanium, stuff like that. Because you can use your portable constructor to turn all of your ores, your basic ores, 
and two ingots. So there's, you should never use your furnace to do your basic ingots. Because you can just go right out in your portable constructor and do that and save all that electricity. Plus, you can free up your furnace to smelt cobalt and titanium and stuff like that. So you're getting more done in less time. So my CV, once we get this done... I'm going to use that advanced constructor to make our stuff for the CV because it's faster. So we can have it made faster. I wish the materials would let you know what you can make it in. But basically why I want this is I want to make that better fuel source because you can't make it in here. Which I find hilarious because you can make this deuterium fuel cells Oh, that's what it is. Okay, never mind. It's for mining equipment. I thought it was for your base. Like to fuel your ships, whatever. But never mind. Those are not for that. I stand corrected. I do need to get some more gold ore. That would be awesome. So we'll see. Almost done. Woo woo. I wonder if it tells me if it'll tell me here. Yeah, it takes 40 seconds just to craft the constructor itself. Come on, come on, come on, come on. So once it's done probably going to put it right here. Is it done? No, because it would be in there. Oh, it is done. I stand corrected. Where is it at? There it is. Oh, sorry. Wrong button. My apologies, everybody. I meant to do this then to do that. Oh, come on. Yeah, look at that. Uh -huh, that's cool. It's like, do do do. Yep, yep. Let's do this. Do 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 do. I like that. It's really good. Come on. Come on. Come on. Let's turn it off. I don't need it powered right now. And I don't need that powered. So let's look at our fuel. Ugh. All right. So, nope, not base. That's what I wanted to make, promethium hydro cells. So let's make 
25 will give me 50. Let's do 10, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Now this is... Why are you needing to make a hydrogen bottle? Are they outside? Like what? What is going on? I will grab that one out of here. I don't see them. So I don't know what the hell's going on. Uh, you don't need to do that. Sorry. I don't understand why it's needing to make hydrogen bottles. Is it in my ship? Is it in the fridge? It's not in the fridge. It's not in the ammo box. So... What happened to all my hydrogen bottles? I know I brought some back. You're you're not going to tell me I didn't bring any. Water containers? I do have water containers. Oh, but that, that gives you 10 hydrogen bottles. I don't, oh, oh, what I did brought back only was enough to make that. So that's what we need. We need... 20 hydrogen bottles which to this would be every 10 water containers Ooh, okay that's probably what it was it just used up so much of my hydrogen bottles 14% well these are going to go for the base because That's who it's for. Now, let's go F4. Disconnect that. So we need a lot of hydrogen bottles. So I need to make another hydrogen machine. check upstairs real quick and then we're gonna have um, our advanced constructor making the stuff that we need for a CV because we've already got over here and this is what we need for our CV let's look at what we already have so we've already got the uh, starter box the core what we need for a CV is we will need a cockpit I wonder, oh, that requires that much CPU. Oof. Oof. 
But I can make an extender already. That would be pretty good. I will say let's make, let go ahead and make a CPU extender. Solar panels would be good too. Oh, so we need a large, yeah, because I can't make, yeah, I could, even if I had Savium, I don't have Zescosium. So we're going to need, where is the cockpit? Right here. So I need Savium plates. Horseshit. So I need a control station. Landing gears is going to be a thing. We do need... Oh, man. That's so much steel. How much titanium do I have? I got some titanium plates right there. And I still got some titanium ore. So that's good. That That's cool. I like that. So I could do steel blocks or hardened steel. It takes one sec or half a second longer, but it gives me better resistance and better integrity through my structure. So let's go with 200 of those. Constructor would be nice, even a small one, to make fuel. But let's go with our containers first. We need a harvester. These hold eight kiloliters per one. And that one holds eight kiloliters. But it says the max that it can, I guess, connect to is 320. I, I don't know how that works. But let's do 10 of those. That'll give us 80 plus another 8 will be 88 kiloliters. That's a lot. Because it's just going to be for us harvesting, which is a lot. Um, how much does the base hold just with what it gives me? 16,000? That's going to be more than enough. Ooh, I may not need that much. <laughs> Um, so we'll probably split it up. We'll, we'll do maybe like four for harvest. Well, no, because let's look at this. If I took five, that would still give me five. I don't know. We'll figure it out. Um, we need an oxygen tank. Definitely need a fuel tank need a generator because that's going to put out 15 kilowatts how much does this take that takes 1.22 kilowatts so let's go with two of those i want to have at least four thrusters for the back two for the front two for the left side, two for the right side, and then what about going down? Oh, that's kind of good too, because look at this, all right, how much, well, we gotta, I'm gonna have to tally up the CPU, but look at this, so this is 10,000 CPU for 12 millinutes. So you're looking at four and a half more for only 2,500 CPU. This is pretty much better to do than medium thrusters. I mean, granted, it costs a lot more in resources, but for 2,500 more CPU, you get 45 4.5 millinutes more. So 
So that's almost double these for less. So let's cancel these. Let's do four for the four for the back. Or four for the back. Yeah. Four for the back. Let's do two for the bottom, two for the top, two for left, two for right. So four for the back, two, four, six, eight, ten. That should be enough right there. Okay, so we need a Pataxa tank. We need landing gears. Probably four of them would be the best. We need a food processor. We need a fridge. What else do we need? Oh, definitely a detector. Definitely wireless connection. Armor locker for sure. One of these doors. A ramp. Oh, ammo controller. I need an ammo controller. Where is... There's an ammo controller. How much does that hold? Eight kilo... Yeah. We'll roll with one of those. Some medical devices. One to give us health back. Did it not? Oh, it must be off the screen. That's whatever. Oh, we need RCSs too. Ooh. That's a huge difference. If you double it, that gives you 40 millinewtons. Or newt meters, sorry. Let's go with one of those. Let's see if that helps. Let's get a ventilator. Mm, and I think that's it. you to make more copper when you get done. Uh, there's that. And let's throw more of these in here. Oh, wrong one. Let's go to the advanced constructor. Constructor. The reason why I'm doing it in the advanced constructor is because it's supposed to be faster. This only needs 12 electronics, but it needs computers. 
which computers is in here. Which needs 15 per computer. So if it needs 12, that is what? 15 times 10 is 150. That's going to need a lot. That's like 200 it needs. Just in those two. What about energy regulators? Energy regulators. Right here. More electronics. So we need a rat ton of electronics. Yeah, just, just keep making electronics. I'm going to get some more silicon. Throw more silicon in there. Keep making them. Keep making them. Uh, what else? What else? What else? Optical fibers. We need to look at optical fibers. I mean, obviously, it's going to need a lot. Computers. Let's look at computers. Optical fibers, three. And computers, eight total. Eight total just in those. What about... Do I need any high energy capacitors? Or high output? Yes. Advanced electronics. Not really a whole lot of optical fibers we need. We need mostly electronics and optical fibers. Let's see what we can make in this portable constructor for blocks. For CVs. We can make regular steel blocks. That's it. So the wireless connection. All those things I need to make out here. Let's not make inside. Same as an armor locker. Let's definitely do that. Because we cannot afford... Like, we don't have a lot of fuel in the base. close to a thousand that's good awesome I'll put this on my my person so that'll go good right there this is only for the base good for that. I think what I need to do is use some of those use some of these blocks up just to help make more room.
this I'll build out there. Armor locker I can build out here. Let me verify again. I can build a fridge. I can build a fridge. I'm trying to get out stuff that I can make out here being made out here. Uh, yeah, you can give me that. Uh, no, I'm not done. Keep making more electronics. <laughs> Don't stop. Like, I will let you know when to stop. Just Keep making it. Oh, I hate to end the episode. Now granted, this is working back and forth for us. So as we use resources, we are Cutting down the volume. I'm out of iron. What? No, I, I want the advanced construction. It's gonna make it. Oh god, no. We'll pause. We'll pause that. We'll go get some iron. Well, I'll do that off screen so you don't have to worry about that. Blocks. Yeah, it can make steel but not reinforced. So that's not a big deal. Yeah, all this stuff I could just make out here. But, yeah. Well, that's going to end the episode of the year. I'm going to go mine the crap ton of iron. Off screen and... I need to make more food. But I hope y'all enjoyed watching. If you did, you know what to do. But I hope you all have a good day, and I'll see you in the next episode. Thanks for watching.